Hello everyone, this is Flipdog and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Um, today, I believe, will hopefully be the last episode. Um, a very short series on my channel, this is the fourth video and I think it's going to be the last one, but that's simply because I am very quick at playing Resident Evil 2 because I've played it so much. Anyway, without any further ado, let's get right back into the game. Alright, so, last episode we managed to get into the nest place, uh, which is where we are now. Um, and, uh, right. Basically, we have to find the G-Virus sample. Um, and last episode I put the shotgun into the item box, because I said there is, um, no... No ammo nearby, and then um, after I stopped filming, it was literally in this room here. Um, I checked in there, and there's nothing else in there. Um, so anyway, let's just go and oh hello, shush. Is um. Well, that's pretty stupid. I can only come into the entrance of the nest if I'm a guest. Oh, hang on, shut up. There we go. Right. Um, let's go this way then. Um. I don't think I'm going to play Devil's Advocate anymore. I know what's going to happen. So I'll just not tell you about what's going to happen. Um, yeah. The, oh, there's a guy right there. I didn't see him. <laughs> I like how I say, oh, I know exactly what's going to happen. And then proceed to miss the guy that's right in front of me. Um, right. Uh, let's defeat that guy. And then go up here. I will enjoy your selection of healthy foods, um, voice thingy, um, but not right now because I have some killing to do. Oh, by the way, guys, I have, I'm on a call with Shane right now, um, but he's doing some stuff, so he might not talk. Longer. Then, as you can see there. Okay, okay, we have two knives now. Hello? Enemy? Ah, yes, he's right there. Boom! I love how it just kills them instantly, even though I'm on normal mode. All you have to do is aim. Um, I never aimed before, and that's why I never did as well. Right, uh, this should be the upgrade for our ship. Now, that thing always has to be in our inventory while we're doing this section of the game. So, we're going to have to be careful. And we got a regulator for the flamethrower. I don't even know what that does. I think it just makes it, like... Um, slightly better. Do you know what a regulator does for a flamethrower, Shane? No. I know nothing about flamethrowers, but I'm... <laughs> I like flamethrowers. Yeah. Flamethrowers are my favourite gun, but is it even uh, a valid point to say they are a gun? I mean, a gun's just something that shoots projectiles, right? And technically the fire is a projectile. Hmm, yeah, good point. Um, is that everyone dead in here? I believe so. Right, there are a lot of good things in here. Um, there was a grenade, but I believe we can use a grenade in a second. Oh look, more ammo. And, yo, how do we have a surplus of ammo? Actually, we can use a grenade here. Um, three, I don't think is going to be enough, um, but... I want to keep my inventory empty as possible. Now, is that everything in here? No, we have fuel, was that? Or was it? Oh, yeah, fuel. Oh, good, good. Blimey. I like how my inventory is suddenly just full. Well, not full, full, but you get the picture. It's okay. Okay, so we've established that a flamethrower is a gun. Epic. Right, let's continue. Then I shall go to the east area. This is pretty, this is uh, just story stuff here. If you want to read it, you'll have to pause it because I'm not doing it. Um, so we need to go over there. Now, I want to get my pistol out because I don't want to use all my shotgun ammo just yet. Um, but basically, we need to go that way. However, due to story purposes, we cannot. Unfortunately. Uh, as you can see, we need a level 3. 
We've only got a level two. This is like SCP um, with the different ranked cards and things. I should probably play a lot more SCP Secret Laboratory on my YouTube channel. My first video didn't do very well, but that's because I did a very terrible title. The most boring match in the world. No one wants to watch a boring match, so that was my own fault that that did not that good. Um, anyway, let's put stuff we don't need into here. And we do need... Uh, hang on, was there any... Did we have any... Uh, let me think. Brain died. No, we didn't. I was trying to say, did we have any gunpowder in there? Uh, oh, and here's some gunpowder. Lovely. Right, now that we have a surplus of pistol ammo, I'm feeling slightly better. But the problem is the enemies we're going to face pretty soon, like literally in the next two rooms over, require the flamethrower. Um, which I do have on my back, obviously. Um, but yes. Anyway, let's go and meet the most horrifying enemies to ever see, in my Jesus. opinion. What happened here? Nobody knows. All right, this door takes its time to open, cause it's a giant plant. It's Resident Evil One all over again. Jesus. These things are horrible. So I'm just gonna knock him down and just uh, gradually set him on Shit. fire. Now these guys um, refuse to die until they are literally a crisp. Um, now he's taking his time. There we go. That's what they have to look like. A literal crisp. Um, Gunpowder? Yeah. Alright. Now over here there is another one. So we'll just um, do that. Now, I really want to make sure they are dead, because, um, remember Fancy Fedora Man? Yeah, well, he's still alive. Uh, spoiler alert, he will come after us when we complete this next section. And we have to run back through here, and it is, um, very dangerous, very scary. So I want to be completely prepared for when he pops up. Now, I've just made a mistake. It's okay. It's okay, we can um, go into here and kill a few enemies. Such as this one here. Oh, and that guy there. You know what, we'll just get them both. And they will burn. Alright, that's one. And that's two. Alright, now we reload. And that's not enough. Right, we need to kill some more then. They should just be dotted around. They fall out of pods that are up in the top of the plant. And you can't actually hit that top part of the plant um, with the flamethrower. So there's not really any point to shoot them. I know. Just wasted my ammo, hadn't he? Right, there we go. Alright, that should be room. Yes. Now, okay. Anyone else who I can get rid of before we do... Well, no. It's a little while yet before it happens. We basically need to get rid of that blockage. I don't know why the flamethrower can't just be used to do it, but, um, game purposes, so, yeah. Right. Now, okay, what do we need to do? Yeah, it was this way. Um, we had to get the thing out of here. Dispensing solution now. Yes. Now basically... That's done absolutely nothing. What we need to do is get this and refill it with the correct solution. Um, but that correct solution is a little bit away from now. So, we need to look at this and we need to memorise it. E, 11, two arrows and then an E. 
All right, you go to here. Yep. Click E11, two arrows, and then E. I just make up nodes so that I remember. Uh, that'll open that, and then I've, we can. I, I know it did down here, but. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm fairly good at remembering that code, and the next code we need is actually on the bottom of an item you pick up, so it should be okay. Right, down we go. Again with my 13 frames per second, but. What are we gonna do? Now over here there is large gunpowder and a map as you can see. Helpful. And uh, now we've got some shotgun shells so we can reload that. And that'll actually get us another space in our inventory. Now in here there are a fair few enemies and it's always better to get rid of them before you um, move down that corridor there because a couple of liquors come and they're nasty so blow up that person's head blow up that person's head blow up that person's head and I think those three are the only ones we need to I don't but think I don't think this dude actually gets up so I'll just check it with my knife <laughs> Yeah, he, he, he's permanently dead. Right. Now, this is the item we need. Um, it's a trophy, as you can see. But on the bottom of it, it's got the cord we need. Now, um, I'm just thinking, should we... Ah, actually, we might be able to do something cool here. If we get the flashbang... Right, watch. Yeah. That always makes me jump. Now, if we get the flashbang and throw that... That scares them. Then if we get the grenade and throw that, that'll severely damage them. And then if we get another one, we do that. That was, I have to say, that was dealt with rather professionally there. Even if I do say more so myself. I've never done that before. I'm very proud of myself. I'm amazing, Shane, aren't I? Yeah. Yeah. See? You never felt amazing. Mm -hmm. Approval from Shane. Always good. Yeah. Right, now we need to yeah, carry need on to back out. I need to go for a second. <laughs> ah, okay. I'll, I'll see you in a bit then. Yeah. Now, there's a dude here. Who I just popped with one shot. That's always good. Now, ah, actually, we should probably get this. Because... Oh. I forgot about you, sir. Please don't. Hang on. Actually, yeah, I'll use my pistol. Oh, no, what have I done? Ah, oh, that was an accident. Now, how does Leon neck get damaged, not get damaged from that? The grenade's still able to damage him there, but it doesn't for some reason. Now, where's the plant dude? There's normally a plant dude that hangs around here, but he doesn't seem to be... Doesn't seem to be interested today. That's fine by me. Well, to an extent. Now, there is a woman over there. Now, I'm kind of just uh, firing because I am over the max ammo and it's taking up space that I don't want it to be taken up. So, that should be you, dead missus. Yep. Alright, good. Um, now there's gunpowder there, but I don't remember any other places that have gunpowder, and we actually need oh, more. Oh my god, we actually need this um, to open some things. Now, what is this? That's a note. Ah, oh, yeah, th that's the those the 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 the, the, the IV things. They're called IV, by the way. Um, yeah, we'll get that gunpowder. Th there might be one elsewhere. Now, the first place we need to use our uh, thing we just picked up is back through the other side of this whole area. Now, I don't think there are any more um, gunpowders for a little while, so I'm going to put it in here. Even though we do get space in a li little bit. Right, I'll get over there. It's the place where we picked up the blue thing. Alright, so I'm back in here now, and um, we need to go all the way down the end here. Uh, 
because for this we need what we've just picked up that says MUF so we go to here click examine change this to MUF with E and then move these with D A D S and W and you have to basically match up the frequencies so like that there we go now that sets we just use that in there and that switches on the power in this area which will open this and get us a pouch and that's the last pouch we get in the game and now this guy will fall out now I always make sure I shoot him now I'm deliberately wasting ammo because I want space in my inventory now he's also got a letter this is the dude uh, Wayne Lee gets a bit of an ego towards the end of his life and then becomes a zombie and he's dead you don't really need to check if he's dead because we don't actually have to come back here but it's always nice now is that everything that's everything let's get back over to the other side Alright, I'm back over this side now, and um, we can now actually uh, use the cord that's on this trophy. Yes, there is a cord on the trophy. Wow. Um, to open something which will let us continue on with the game. Now, we need to go to here. Well, first we need to examine this. It says, arrows, 1L, big square, little square, big chunk. Right. Arrows, little L, big square, little square, and big chunk, and then that. Yeah. Right, that opens to something in the other room. Uh, we can now delete this. Gets us some more space, and um, we'll move that over there and just keep the extra ammo there. Right, this next puzzle is um, fairly difficult in my opinion. I'm not very good at it. Now, I'm going to pick up this, and actually, I'm going to pick up the one. The other piece that was over here as well. It was a blue herb. And that'll get us another full healing item in a little bit. So I'm just going to move these. There we go. I really don't like that sound. It's as if there's still ones alive. It's probably just the plant itself. But anyway, now we're in here. Uh, there are no enemies in here. There is a dead guy that you may suspect of coming back up. Um, basically, this is what we have to do. We have to put an empty cartridge into the solution, collect the right amount, and then cool it immediately. Um, for game purposes, you don't have to cool it immediately. You can run around doing whatever the heck you want. And yep, gunpowder he here, just as I thought there'd be. <laughs> Ironic, because now we don't have the gunpowder. And there is also an extra grenade which is always good now for the difficult bit um, I do actually have the achievement for doing this in like seven or nine moves but that's simply because I did it I just followed a YouTube video now I'm just gonna guess here I have no idea what I'm doing but hopefully this will be correct now, if I swap uh, them ones around, okay, okay, not gonna lie, I was not expecting to do that, like, within that time limit, I thought I was gonna have to cut out a large section, but there wouldn't have even been a jump cut there, um, that was amazing, wow, right, um, Anyway, that's good. Uh, let's continue. Now we need to go back down the big hatch we opened and um, do some stuff down there. Now I'm um, anticipating what's to come in the future. Um, well, I mean in this game, that is uh, not future future. There is a boss battle soon and I am slightly worried. Sorry, I've just done the wrong thing. And I'm slightly worried I might die in it. Um, it's my least favourite boss battle in the entire game. And I am not too good at it. However, I am going to see if I can be awesome. I'm not going to save. Now, if I don't save, um, that'll be 
probably catastrophic because um, obvious reasons but hopefully everything will be fine now we need to go over here and this will get us a another gunpowder that will get us some shotgun shells and now I can move that to there um, there is some more fuel that's a surprise I forgot I didn't even know that was there well I must have but forgot um right well i don't need that just yet um i could put that back in there don't need them just yet there is a item box before that previously mentioned boss battle um and i'll just pick up this knife just in case now by the way those um plant things we've been fighting they will kill you in one shot if you don't have any protective items so it's always better to get them um, and have at least two on you. Now they're dead. That's all good. We now need to go into here. And um, I don't think there are any items in this area. Which is a bit weird. Um, this is some more stuff. This is uh, inbox if you want to read them. Just pause. Anyway. Right. Now we go into here, and I believe there is stuff around. It's very cold in here, obviously, as you can see by the frost. Now, Leon is a bit silly. He didn't realize that this is the freezer. Oh, and we got more sh um, gunpowder, so that's good. Um, now we have to put this in here. This is not really important to see, but I'll just show you it anyway. For YouTube purposes. There we go. That's our stuff ready. Now we have to get back out of here. Um, now, the first time I played this through... I'm fairly sure that um, this zombie out here got up, but they don't, doesn't seem to now, just dead. So that's fine by me, we don't have to worry about that. Now let me just check, uh, I'm a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to this game. Right, yeah, that's everything, we just need to get back up the other way now. Uh, I'll get back up there and uh, just skip. Alright lads, I'm back in this room. And I have stocked up on weapons and ammo, as you can see. Well, as much as possible. Um, I probably should have done the same for healing items, but hopefully three will be fine. Anyway, now we go into the next section. Right. Now, I want to make sure that everything in here is dead. Now there's this one here, so we'll just uh, Son of a bitch. start with it. Now I just want to make sure they are absolutely dead because they can be a bit of a nuisance if they're not. There we go. Now we do have 10 extra ammo in here, but what's about to happen will make that negligible. Well, I actually know it won't because um, Fancy Fedora Man isn't affected by that. Shit. Yep, guess who's back? Back again. Fancy Fedora Man is back. Tell a friend. Now, yeah, there are more around, but. Um, because we dealt with them already, we don't have to deal with them. That guy we would have killed on the way in, but the dude who we killed there would have already have dropped down and made it bad for us, so you should kill him beforehand. Now, when you get to about here, you are okay. He won't chase you anymore. Um, and that's, that's always good. He, he's not going to be a problem. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, that's basically all you got to do in that situation. Um, 
Now we move on to the next bit. And the next bit is um, slightly difficult. Now, I want my... Obungulite. Oh, hello. What? Sorry. What did you say? I said Obungulite. Oh, yes. Epic. I'm about to go on to the, my least favourite boss battle of the entire game that's actually fairly difficult. So wish me luck, Shane. And I'm doing a thing where I don't save until the end of each episode, so... Yeah. Right. OSS, the first one, and... um. Do 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 oh nearly there we go and uh, we have to click use on that there we go restores power we can now delete that now we can watch this uh, tape we got now this one's pretty cool I think it it, it just gives you a bit of lore really. Pardon me. I didn't know you were coming. This is my life's work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. Hold your fire. Ooh. Trigger happy. What the fuck were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive. Not Martinez. We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the samples, then. Right. So, yeah, basically, they should not have shot him there. That was bad. Um, you'll see in a little bit why. Um, I won't spoil it. I mean, it's not exactly as if it can be spoiled. You've probably already seen this game, but yeah. Uh, this is his inbox if you want to read it. There we go. Now we can delete that. Always good. Um, now. Uh, yes, I, if I remember correctly, yes. Um, we'll just pick up everything as we go on. Not that I can pick up everything. There are a few items that I won't be able to. Right, I believe that's everything. Yeah, yeah. Right, let's continue and go through the disinfectant. Lovely. <laughs> right. Right, this place is the weird place. I mean, look at this. This is all just weird, man. Look at a hand. Right, now, I'm just going to put this stuff that we picked up away. Actually, oh, that's helpful. That's actually good. All right, maybe we won't have to put them away. Um, Now, oh, I'll have to put this blue herb away. Maybe, maybe not. Um, Oh, no, there's a green herb. Oh, boys. This is awesome. How have I, like, done this? I've just got a lot of stuff that's, like, helpful and things. Um, right, uh, can we take that out? No, we can't take it out because it's full, which is really weird. It sh you should just be allowed. And, like, combine it directly from the box. Now, I don't think we'll need four. Um, but that's a very big don't think. Um... Now, yes, I know we're out of space now for... We don't have any ammo for the Desert Eagle or whatever it is. The Magnum, that's what it is. Um, however, I am very nervous because I have never managed to do this boss battle in one go. Right. All right. Now back to Ada. Mm -hmm. So, we got the thing. Now it's time 
for horror. Uh, I always grimace at that section. So he is still alive. Yep. Oh look, it's a net! <laughs> With her crappy grenade launcher as a pistol. I reckon that's a flare gun that she's just putting grenade rounds in. Don't get close to it. Why? <laughs> So he actually survived that pew pew there. And he had one of the samples. And he injected himself with it. Oh, man. Good God, William. What have you done? <laughs> what have you done? Oh, my God. He's still alive. He's still alive. Oh no. And he has evolved. Ow. Oh. As disgusting as that is, it is pretty cool. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that hardcore parkour. Well done, Leon. Right. Let's get this horror over with. Give him the burn. Feel the burn from being constipated. And I'm already losing. What have I done? Right, we have to aim. That's important. Yes, got one. Right, hide, 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 hide. He started a fire. Now run quickly. Oh my god, how did you catch me there, my friend? Look at this mad lad. He's absolutely insane. Right. That's one. No, that's two. That's two. That's two. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, I don't want to hide here, though. That's not going to help. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Didn't do anything. Oh, I know I ran into the fire. What am I doing? Ah. Oh, yes. This is good. He's annoyed now. This is good. He's weak. Ah. 
Come on. I'm doing so badly. Wait, what ammo do we have? Flamethrower ammo. Nah, uh, yes! Yes! Haha! <laughs> oh! Get in! Oh, man. Alright. Everybody, panic off. I am awesome. Yes! Oh, man. Alright, that's the first time I've ever done that first try as Leon. I am so happy. Look at how much ammo and health we use. Like, everything. Oh, man. That was awesome. Right, watch this be like another ton. Yeah, wow. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm happy with that, right. <laughs> okay, so... That's not the end of the stress, though, because there is... One more boss battle on Leon's playthrough, and it is fairly difficult. Um, just gonna say it. It's with Fancy Fedora Man, and I'm also gonna say it. I personally don't really think I want to fight Fancy Fedora Man. He's been such a inspiration throughout this entire game, always making me continue. I, I don't want to fight him, guys. <laughs> We're gonna have to. <laughs> Shane, I don't know if you heard, but I, I I beat him first try. I don't even know if you're still there. Epic. Yeah, it was it was awesome. I I'm so proud of myself just for that small achievement. <laughs> Jesus, that looks bad. <laughs> Feels worse. Believe me. Oh dear. Talk about what you said. How much I believe. Just tell me you'll destroy that G sample. Evidence. It's going to the FBI. <laughs> you trust that bitch? What's that supposed to mean? She's not FBI. She's a mercenary. Dun, 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 dun. G virus is gonna go to the highest bidder. Dun, 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 dun. She died. Gets into the wrong hands. Oh my god, she dead. She dead, boys. <laughs> Leon's like, I don't know what to think now, boys. Whew. Right. On we go. <laughs> Through the reverse of the disinfection. Oh, lovely! The self instruct, the self destruct has activated. Right, we need to refill on health items before we continue. And uh, oh, I should probably reload my magnum. That would help. There we go. Then that can go down there. We can get another health item. And everything can be good. Now I believe there are some more stuffs we need to pick up, so I'm gonna leave one space free. Yes, now look, there's no one there at all. Now watch. Da -da -da, surprise. And so we can go now. I was just thinking about you. That makes two of us. I was getting worried. Hmm. You know, we make a good team. I gotta ask you something. The way's clear. Please, tell me you got it. Oh, I got it. Can you verify the G sample when we get the hell out of here? Before we do that, I ran into Annette. She claims you're not FBI. Alright, watch. 
This. Wrong move. Wrong move. Never do that. That was the wrong move, people. She was not supposed to pull the gun. I was just some pawn to you. Look, I'm just doing my job. And I'm doing mine, so drop that damn gun. Oof. I'm taking you in. Hand over the sample, Leon. I don't want to hurt you. And you shoot me. But I don't think you can. Ooh, ultimatum. <laughs> He's like, oh no. He's crapping his pants right now, boys. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Oh, bye bye. Down it goes. No one gets that now. Epic. Come on, Leon. Leon, Leon, you need to pull Ada up, man. There was a chance you could have got into a DMs there. Hold on. I think I can... Yes. Oh. I reckon that if that slight bit there hadn't happened, he would have been able to pull her up. It's not worth it. Don't do this. <laughs> How has he not slipped off there? <laughs> Bye boys, I had my head out. Take care of yourself, Leon. Du -du -du. No! Oh no! Darth Vader no here, boys. No. Oh, it's so sad. Oh. <sighs> oh, right, Leon, get out of there now, mate. It, run. You know that bridge isn't held well, very well together. There, that that's not doing nah, so well. Not. If it just collapses like that, from a slight shake. All right. We're on a timer now. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Right. So sad. She died. Oh. It was all going so well. But seriously, Ada should not have pulled the gun on Leon there. She should have, like, come up with a reason. Like, Annette was just bluffing to get... To get her... To get Leon to doubt her. Like, the, that's what the imposter should do in Among Us. They should lie. But lie in a way that's believable. Because basically, Ada just confirmed that she was the bad guy by pulling a gun on Leon there. Which you shouldn't do. <laughs> Confirm that you're the enemy, so... Yeah. Right. Let me out. And yes, there is a, another health out here. Okay. Actually, um... Swap them around because or C D. Oh, and there's a little extra bit here. Who's that? Oh my god, it's Claire. She's alive. Is it? Oh, is it? It is Leon? You're down here too. Yeah. But the whole place is coming down. Listen to me. You need to get out. Fast. Yeah. You still there? <laughs> Leon? Hey Leon, you're breaking up. Forget about Inconvenient me. timing Just be like. <sighs> Damn it. Right. Oh, the chase is on, boys. Here we go. And yes, no time went down during that whole conversation. Which is epic. Right, go, go, go! Run as fast as you can! And I'm just just gonna put some sort some stuff. I don't think we'll need three. No, I didn't want to. I didn't want to do that. But we will need the other things, probably. Right, let's do this. Oh, I forgot these things were here. Oh no. What the? 
Yes. Okay, that should do. Oh, yep, of course, there's just a random health item down here. You know what? Take it, I don't care. Alright, down we go, boys. Oh, no, fancy Fedora Man's back. Oh, no. Where is he? Which way is he going? Oh, he's going this way. Fancy Fedora Man. Now is not at the time, mate. Like, I am running for my damn life here. And I'm not going to bother shooting that dude. He's just random. Go, go, go. All the way. Yes, the door's there. Go, come on. Ooh, uh oh. That's not good. Leon. Oh. He got caught by Fancy Fedora Man. Ooh. Now you see... Fancy Fedora Man would have killed Leon there if that thing hadn't exploded. He's not like Nemesis from Resident Evil 3 who just plays with the victims. He will just crush the head. Okay, so he's dead. That's good. Yes, you do, Leon. But you've actually been given a bit of a um, head start by being thrown down a massive cliff. And oh, no. Oh, I forgot about this. We need to pick up something. Oh, no. Right, 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 right. Hang on. We should be able... I don't think we need that anymore. Right, hang on. Let me let me figure this out. Right, pick up that. Put it over here, but don't do the thingy just yet. Right. Put that in there. Then get back. No, oh no. It just makes you do it anyway. Oh, that's a big explosion. Oh well, it should be fine. Why is the ground rumbling so much? Ooh. Like, this is a very bad self destruct system. How is anyone. Oh my word. Fancy Fedora Man has survived. I repeat, he has survived, and now he's here to kill me. Come on, Come on then, you potato! Oh my god, he's got he's got like a massive mutated arm. Oh my god, this is insane! Oh, he's got a giant heart just in his chest. He's a mutant. I thought he was just a really strong dude who had a terrible vitamin D deficiency, but nah, this is insane. Back up, mate. I'm sorry. You're not getting me today. I refuse. Oh my gosh, I've got barely any ammo left. Oh, this is bad. Woo! That nearly landed on me. Oh, that dodge. I'm not going to dodge that one. Okay, apparently I did. Yo, this is like Ring Around the Rosies. It's like Piggy in the middle or something. I don't know. Oh, he's angry. Oh, my God. What is happening? Hide. Oh, he still damaged me. That's not good. Oh, no, he's doing it again. He's doing it again. Okay, no he isn't, it's okay. I do, I have more ammo. I was just about to say, do I have any more ammo? But yes, I have this. I really need him to move over here. No, come on, Leon! Yes, he does it again. Okay, okay, okay. Right. Come on, come on. He's just like... Urgh. Oh. Oh. <gasps> yes. 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 Come on. Shiam. 
Now it's really lucky that that actually landed on the platform we're on. She's still alive! Woo! I don't care, give me it now! Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Are you ready? Foos Rodar! <laughs> it full of just exploded him! Oh, that is. Wow! <laughs> yes! Oh, that is brilliant! All right, okay, let's get at it. I do not care. <laughs> We've got anti-tank rockets. Oh, this is brilliant. I love it. All right, are we here? Are we good? Oh my gosh, yes. It's a train. Leon, what are you waiting for? Leg it, man. Come on. Oh, duh. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. He's okay. He's okay. Come on. Yeah. Oh. That was close, Leon. I'm not going to lie. Oh, man. That was amazing. Whew. Hmm. Hey, I thought we put that in the box. Liar. Oh, that's so sad. He just throws it away. Oh, I got the shivers, I got the goosebumps. Oh, oh that's sad. She died. Except she didn't. Oh, look! She's alive! Claire lives. We made it. Yay! Oh, that glorious music just gives me goosebumps. Well, that, my friends, was Resident Evil 2, the remake. I really hope you enjoyed watching me uh, play this and get my butt scared out of my skin. Not that there were that many places where it happened, but it did happen. It was very tense and very fun. Um, I definitely enjoyed filming it. Um... I'm sorry there were only like, f there were only four videos in it, but um, I've played it so much that I can complete the game in four hours now. So, and with an hour, with each video being an hour, it, it is going to be short. But yes, I hope you enjoyed, and um, now I just have to save up for Resident Evil 3, um, which I believe is now back to being 50 quid again, which is never any good, but um, hopefully I'll get some money for my birthday, which is pretty soon. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. Tap subscribe and the notification bell if you want to see some more. And I'll leave you all with the credits. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you, Shane.
<laughs> I'm watching somebody uh, 3D model Rexy from Jurassic Park. <laughs> cool. And the music's in the background. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Uh, I'm just watching the credits now. I always leave the credits in with the videos that I make. Yeah. I think I think it prevents copyright, to be honest. Um, in a way. I don't know if it would legally, but yeah. morally. Yeah. Morally, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a lot better to do that. <laughs> That that's that's one of the reasons why, but I also just like to watch the credits as well. So it's, it's a I really do with weird. games. I don't with movies, believe it or not. I don't like doing it with movies, but if I if it's a game, I do enjoy looking at the credits. Yeah, that, yeah, same. Here. Because I think it's because it's like you feel like you've worked on it as well because you put that effort into complete it, and it's like you get to see that and like just kind of think over everything you've done to complete the game. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's playing it's playing the fancy Fedora Man music. That's cool. And also, it's rather beneficial for me to listen to it, uh, to listen to it, because for my music uh, course, and I have to listen to like the music used in media, basically, and mm. how it replicates what's happening music on screen. Course. Sorry, I got confused. Are you doing music at sixth form? Or yeah, is yeah. Just like a thing you do no, I'm doing my mu- I'm doing music at um, sixth form. How's that? It's just pretty good. I'm enjoying it. Is there any performance? If there isn't, I'm gonna actually flip. I'm gonna flip because that's the whole reason I wanted to do it. Um, I'm not sure. There haven't really been any mentions of performance. The main thing that initially made me want to go to Durham Six Farm was that I didn't think there'd be performance in the music class, and I wanted to study music. Right. Oh. Um, there isn't much in new colleges, but there is some, which worries me a bit. Right. Oh, there's a Mega Charizard Y battle on in a gym nearby. I'm not going to take oh part. I'll, I'll be that soon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just waiting on this payment coming through. I'm getting like really impatient because I like I've <laughs> forgotten all day that I was meant to get that payment, mm-hmm. and now that I've remembered it, it's really annoying me. Yeah, I hate it when that happens. It's like, oh, now there's something I've forgotten. Yeah. Oh, I like this music as well. It's 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 like the ba- last battle that we did, um, the one that I normally die on at least once. So what's the next game you plan on progressing to? Or are you still uh, going through some? Um, I want to complete all the Resident Evil games. Um, I'm not sure what else I actually want to play for YouTube. I've got a few PlayStation games, but I'm going to wait until I have a capture card to be able to do that. Yeah. Um. I suppose I could make some phasmophobia videos. Um, they seem. Tell you what videos well. I always find cool, and I thought it would be a good opportunity, but I don't know if it would suit your channel very well. But although, also, it seems like you have a wide range of types of videos you do anyway. Mm-hmm. Um, the learning progress videos with instruments with you just starting piano, you could do that, and they kind of jump in there. It would take mm-hmm. a long time, but what was that? it just shot this what? I just missed. Uh, could scene at the end of the game. Oh, I remember. Why did I only get A? I wanted an S, for God's sake. <laughs> oh, all that effort. Oh, well. Oh, my God. I completed the game in three hours and 48 minutes. That's the quickest I've completed it casually now. Damn, I think that's really close to Jack's time. I don't know if he did Resident Evil 2 or 3, though. He did number 3. Yeah, he and, did that. And in number that, three, like basically the same yeah, thing. number three only takes shorter, like it? three hours first playing it, to be honest. Uh, yeah. But yeah. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.